left part, officially known as John F. Kennedy Plaza, holds a special place in the hearts of skateboarders worldwide. Situated in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, this iconic urban plaza became a mecca for skaters during the 90s and early 2000s. Its unique architecture, unforgiving granite ledges, and smooth surfaces turned it into a legendary spot that defined a generation of skateboarders. smooth, polished granite surfaces that adorn Love Park were a skateboarding dream come true. The ledges, stairs, and benches offered a perfect canvas for skaters to showcase their skills. The consistency of the stone and the expert craftsmanship of the architecture made it an ideal spot for learning and mastering tricks. The unforgiving nature of the granite forced skaters to refine their technique, leading to a generation of highly skilled individuals who could handle even the most challenging terrain. Throughout the 90s, Love Park became a cultural epicenter for skateboarders. It wasn't just about the skating, but the community that formed around it. Skaters from all walks of life converged on Love Park, forging bonds over a shared passion. The park became a melting pot of styles and influences, giving rise to a unique skateboarding subculture that blended elements of punk, hip-hop, and street fashion. Local skaters like Ricky Oyola, Josh Collies, and Stevie Williams emerged as ambassadors of Love Park. Their distinctive styles and mastery of the plaza's terrain elevated them to legendary status within the skateboarding community. Their influence reached far beyond Philadelphia, as videos and magazines disseminated their Love Park sessions to eager skaters around the world. Love Park's cultural impact wasn't limited to skateboarding. It played a central role in the broader context of urban exploration and street culture. Graffiti artists, photographers, and filmmakers were drawn to the visually striking architecture and vibrant atmosphere. Love Park became a canvas for self-expression, with its oh, ledges yeah. and benches bearing the marks of countless skaters and artists. However, Love Park's popularity with skaters wasn't always met with open arms. Local authorities frequently clashed with skateboarders, viewing them as a nuisance rather than a cultural force. Attempts to discourage skating included the application of anti-skateboarding devices and even police enforcement. Nevertheless, this only served to strengthen the resolve of the skating community, leading to a defined spirit that became synonymous with Love Park itself. <laughs> the city of Philadelphia embarked on a renovation project that aimed to transform the plaza into a more family-friendly space. This decision was met with significant opposition from the skateboarding community, who saw it as a direct assault on a place that held profound cultural significance. The renovation of Love Park was completed in 2002, and the once skatable granite ledges were replaced with more skate-resistant materials. The distinctive fountain, which had provided the backdrop for countless skate sessions, was removed. The transformation of Love Park marked the end of an era, leaving a void in the skateboarding world. Despite this, Love Park's legacy endures. Its impact on skateboarding culture reverberates through the years, influencing subsequent generations of skaters and shaping the way they approach urban terrain. Love Park lives on in the memories of those who were fortunate enough to experience it in its heyday, and in the stories passed down to newer generations of skateboard. Love Park stands as a testament to the power of skateboarding to transform urban spaces into cultural landmarks. Its unique design, unforgiving granite ledges, and vibrant community turned it into an iconic spot for skaters in the 90s and early 2000s. The park's influence extended far beyond Philadelphia, shaping the skateboarding subculture and leaving an indelible mark on the world of street skating. Though Love Park may have undergone a transformation, its legacy lives on in the hearts and memories of skaters worldwide.